Well, recently a visitor reported that two AA batteries have been dropped in our sea lion and seal exhibit pool. We did bring the sea lions off exhibit immediately, and one of the keepers got in and dove the pool looking for the uh, two batteries that had been dropped in. We did recover one right away, but the second battery uh, we weren't able to find. We have two sea lions, Owen and Diesel. Uh, we weren't sure which of those animals had potentially ingested the battery. Our seals generally don't play with uh, foreign objects in their pool, but the sea lions are very curious and they've been known to do that. The first thing we wanted to know was, did one of them in fact ingest a battery? So we were able to crate up our sea lions inside our holding area and the vets performed radiographs. After they performed the radiographs and looking at them, they did see the battery inside um, one of our sea lion's stomach, our sea lion Owen. It was a big deal because any kind of uh, foreign object ingestion by our animals could lead to serious medical problems. In the case of a battery, um, they contain harmful chemicals that can be corrosive to living tissue. Our vet staff called out specialists from uh, the NC State Vet School where they brought their own special equipment. The sea lion was immobilized again and um, they did the endoscopy again and were able to remove the battery that night. If they hadn't been reported, then we may never have known that he had ingested it until it was potentially too late. So as a zoo visitor, if you see any foreign objects in an exhibit or an exhibit pool, if you report it to um, ZooCom or to any kind of staff member right away, it increases the chances that we'll be able to retrieve the object before an animal could potentially eat it or be harmed in some other way by it.